Hi guys, this is JS and Remote Sensing Basic YouTube channel. If you're newly watching this channel, subscribe it. Today we go to see how to do supervised and unsupervised classification in NV. Okay, now I open NV. See, I open NV Classic version using open image file. First of all, I am going to open the false color composite for one region see this is already layer stacked ok see this is a supervised classification methods and this is the unsupervised classification methods ok for supervised classification we go to create one uh, region of interest this is available in basic tool region of interest ROI tool ok this is the image the first one this is the scroll bar this one this is zoom tool this window this is three different windows I am going to give a region of interest using the zoom window first of all I am going to select the hilly region this red regions are hilly region so this is selected now ok this is the second region of interest area so I rename the region of interest here first one the hills I am um, create the second region for this see this is the settlements regions this is the second region so I give the settlements here This is the second example region of interest for settlements. Okay, third one is agriculture land. See, this is the agriculture land. This is the second example for region of interest. this is varied between the colors red green blue hills is red settlements is green agriculture land is blue uh, now i save the uh, roi region of interest i select this all and choose the files where i want to say save ok it is saved now I am going to do the supervised classification first method parallel prepared here is this is asking, uh, asking FCC ok these are the classes I selected I choose memory here for temporary saving see the first parallel prepared supervised classification is running ok it is completed I opened it in a new window see the differences of super uh, sorry the surprise classification parallel buffer method result now the minimum sorry maximum likelihood classification I select the FCC here and I select all the region of interest I choose memory for temporary saving
okay it's completed i open this in new window see this is a maximum likelihood classification okay now i am going to do the unsupervised classification before that i close this also press to results okay oh and supervised classification first one iso data method here i select the fcc and the number of classes minimum is 5 and maximum is 6 and i just give the okay now it's running okay now i open this in new display see this is the iso data classification i open now k means classification method i select here the fcc same one i give number of classes 6 and i choose the memory for temporary saving compared to supervised classification and supervised classification gives the more uh, accurate results otherwise you go to do the digitization for classify the objects okay it is completed see this the second k means classification results okay thank you for watching subscribe for more videos